And that is essentially the gospel. To preach this gospel is to lead people to become part of a new race. Okay. And he says, God has given us apostleship to bring about obedience to the faith among all the Gentiles for his name's sake. God calls certain people to spread this wonderful gospel across the world. And I tell you, it's the greatest honor a human being can ever have to make this gospel clear and plain to human beings who belong to this old fallen race that they can come and become a part of this new race that God is building. And if you see the glory of that, you will see the tremendous honor it is if God ever calls you to serve him. You know, God doesn't call everybody. He calls perhaps 1% of Christians to serve him full time. 1%. Imagine if you are going to be in that 1% of people called by God to spend your days full time leading people to experience this wonderful gospel. I don't believe God could have ever given me a greater honor than that. Anything in the world is garbage compared to that. Paul saw the greatness of his calling. What are all your engineers and doctors and computer scientists and specialists and whatever they are compared to the glory of being one who proclaims the gospel of God? It's trash. Absolute rubbish. Okay, they make more money. So what? Is there anything more glorious than transforming people to become a part of this new race. we got to see the dignity and the glory of our calling. As I've gone on with the Lord, the dignity and the glory of the calling of being a servant of the Almighty God has just become more and more glorious in my eyes. And I pray that you young people will see the glory of it right from your youth. Of course, if God hasn't called you to that type of thing, well, it's another thing, but if God's called you, there's absolutely nothing. I cannot imagine how anybody can give up the call of God to go for something else. I cannot imagine it. Obviously, he hasn't seen the glory of it. And people talk about, I sacrificed this job to go and serve the Lord. Such people have never seen the glory. They haven't seen the glory of it. That's why they talk about all their sacrifices. I mean, to use an illustration, it's like a man saying, I gave up this 500 rupee job for the sake of this 20,000 rupee a month job. <laughs> That's a joke. Is that a sacrifice? That you gave up a 500 rupee a month job to get a 20,000 rupee a month job? It is something like that. When you give up some earthly job because God called you to serve him full time, to live for him. It's far greater than that. That's what Paul says, I'm an apostle. I'd have wasted my time as a businessman in Tarsus. God called me to be an apostle. The glory of it. To go among all the nations. Proclaiming this wonderful gospel. 